Welcome back to Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Well, this is really exciting. Amber Morgan here. She has won $500,000 and getting set to play for $1 million. I tell you what, she has had quite a run here tonight. We had to overturn a wrong answer for a new question when we found out that some of our maps were not accurate in our research as they can get drawn differently, so we felt it to be fair that we discarded the question like it was never asked. And here she is, getting set to play for the million. Now, Amber, before I reveal the question, I have to say that you are one of the most interesting contestants I have ever seen. We learned that you went to a couple of different elementary schools, the one that you mentioned, Vogelway Elementary in Germany. You're also a cosmetology graduate, substitute teacher, married mother of two beautiful children, and definitely smart. I have to say that I'm very impressed by how you've been doing in your life, and I know for a fact that there are still better things for you down the road, and I wish you all the best, Amber. You're welcome. And also, ladies and gentlemen, also, also, I think I might have pointed this out. The first million dollar winner in Jeff Foxworthy's era, Kathy Cox, was the superintendent for the Georgia school system where Amber went to high school, as she said over the commercial breaks. So Amber, if Kathy Cox is watching this today, she's watching a student that she was superintendent of play for this million. And I bet that she is rooting for you. I'm rooting for you. The students are rooting for you. Your husband is rooting you on. As well as this audience. You guys rooting for her? Amber, good luck to you. The subject for the million dollar question is U.S. history. And the question for one million dollars is this. What year did the U.S. Civil War end? What year did the U.S. Civil War end? Take your time. Take your time, Amber. Which two you're in between? Don't overload yourself, Amber. Just take your time. Try to think carefully. Amber, you're making me teary-eyed when you go do your best, do your best, do your best. Reminds me very much of Kathy Cox. You knew so many facts. You knew some from the Civil War. You said it lasted about four years, did you not? Look at the board, Amber. In what year did the U.S. Civil War end? The key word there is year. You think it lasted about four years. The reality is it lasted about 48 months in all. That's right, so four years is just about accurate. It started when Confederate forces attacked Fort Sumter in South Carolina. They're shot was fired on April 12, 1861. And about 48 months later, on April 9, 1865, the Confederacy surrendered... RJ, you were right! Amazing! Amazing intuition there! Amber, I will say this much. A million dollars goes a long way. Food on the table.
a roof over your house, your husband can start building your all's dream home, and you can send your beautiful daughters to college with that money. That is certainly amazing. <laughs> and Amber, I congratulate you. I must say, Amber, that was sensational. And Amber, it gives me a great deal of pleasure to know that in the primetime history of this show, you are the third person that ever gets to say this. There's the camera. Jeff, how you doing, man? We'll see you next time on Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Goodbye, everybody! Woo!